गुड मॉर्निंग गुड मॉर्निंग सर हाय ऑल ऑफ यू सो टुडे वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट द हाउ टू इम्प्रूवमेंट सेफ्टी एट एट द कंस्ट्रक्शन प्रोजेक्ट दिस इज वेरी इम्पोर्टेंट फॉर ऑल ऑफ यू बिकॉज ऑफ इफ यू आर वर्किंग इन कंस्ट्रक्शन सेक्टर देन दिस इज ए मोस्ट चैलेंजेस जॉब to how to improvement good safety health safety good health safety culture in your construction project because i am a safety professional i am working with a construction company last 14 years and also i am looking a safety especially for occupational health safety during the uh, since start the my careers in construction field i have completed mechanical engineering and advanced diploma as well as lead auditor course 14001 and 2015 environment management system and occupational health safety management system osa osa 80001 2015 and as well as during the on course of uh, my work the past 3 years 4 years i have also com- completed internal iso 14001 2018 certification course and also my organizations first uh, first iso 40001 and 2018 certifications done in 2019 which are when i used to work bhate and rajya construction company my total experience is 14 years in my career i have uh, we have completed many project Uh, project in india uh, in whole of uh, many st- uh, entire um, 14 years i uh, 14 years i have comp- my experience in construction field especially for safety and we have completed many project with respect to safety and Uh, a safety and safety with well quality re- with uh, respect to quality of work and achievements 9 million 10 million pre accident safe man hour in construction project a single project 10 hours a uh, 10 million pre accident safe man our achievements a commercial building which was located in uh, mumbai and client was their loma it park so there are many people working approx 1200 uh, workers are there worker was there uh, with 200 staff and this was very big project commercial project 22 floors building entire uh, approx 3 lakh square meter in uh, 3 lakh square uh, feet of uh, um, of uh, surface uh, land we have developed and with respect to safety we have achievements free uh, safe man hours and also many awarded given by the uh, trusted suppose the pune research pcrf award cid award during the my work with respect to in terms of safety as well as i have as well as i have well experience in the constructions field so today a uh, a construction field 
and depend on how we are improving good health safety culture this is a very good and popular questions by the management because of i know that if you are going to when i i going to conduct an interview then most of hr these questions ask for all the candidate who are who become a good position good manager uh, good uh, position so like the safety manager corporate head so this is a biggest questions to how to improve good health safety culture so guys uh, today uh, so we have a basic implementation of safety at the project a project first we have depend on ohs policy we have depend on as a safety professionals we have depend on safety policy which type of safety policy being used by the organization because the each and every safety scope of improvement depend on the ohs policy which are expressed expressed by the and delivered by the state delivered by the expressed by the managing director and signing on the ohs policy what is the expectation what is the need and expectations for the organization by the managing director what he want to occupational health safety improvement as per a legal requirement of ohs policy so depend on ohs policy because of you know that uh, every organization is taking a good certification good ohs policy everything is a good documentation part of very strong but on ground there is no safety system zero safety improvement at ground but only for certifications to so the uh, so the uh, for showing purpose to clients i am a certified we are a certified company we are taking in but on ground zero so two type of management are there first is there only for i was to others persons and one is really doing well and with respect to ohs policy so first if you are going to improvements then we should proper our ohs plan with dedications of work dedications of management so this is a very important part of improvement good health safety cultures in your construction field please be careful if you are working as safety professional so this is a big challenge of if you have a good health safety e policy then we can improvements then we can talk the all down grade uh, down grade which are working below the junior level so ohs policy is very important after that good ohs occupational health safety management system so we have plan we should have plan if you are working as safety professional you have to have a yes a good ehs plan as per project specific safety plans so which are are in details how to improve and good safety what is your process to improve and good health safety cultures at your project and sign by the managing the um, do not uh, need to sign by the manage. there are need to be signed by the project head which are under control the project which is controlled by the organization uh, project so must be signed and keep in file and as a safety process you should improvement channel first we have good planning then we can improvement good health safety cultures and also safety policy we have uh, communicated to other persons to downgrade workers staffs they can understood what are the company requirement what art company uh, company want to what dedications of occupational health safety cultures 
then explain them all workers explain them uh, uh, explain them all staffs among of staffs then we can improvement uh, this is a good things of improvement good health care tickle check and construction project <laughs> next we are talking about the safety safe operating procedures safe operating procedures means each and every activity wise safe operating procedures is very important and we should have to have safe operating procedures and good safe operating in procedure and standard we can say the safe operating standard so must be developed in construction project with it then and signed by the responsible persons which are working on site so they can understood that what is our responsibility to every work must be done with the safe operating procedure work method statements and hazard identifications risk assessment environment aspect impact so all these things need to be developed before you start the any project this is a part of improve this is part of planning if you have a good plans then we can improve good health safety culture check project so guys this is very important for you if you are going to improvement and do a safety culture next we are talking about the safety training safety training is very important if you have a good plan if you have a good safety policy if you have a resource good resources in construction project they are very talented person about the safety but you have no plan then this is not possible to improve so you should must make a good planning otherwise do not we cannot improve in good health safety culture <laughs> okay so training part of training this is very effectiveness you if you have working the safety professionals then you understood that after conduct the training approx 10% safety level if you have conducted 100 uh, attendees uh, in during the up uh, your training so then 90% people so may be aware about the safety perhaps 2 10% and 10 uh, no, 2% 5% persons is not understood your language understood your uh, training not it effective because everyone not in a one uh, one type of people in our construction project they are different of minds so how can how can collaborate well collaborate with worker well collaborate with your pmc staff with uh, well collaborations with the all those team working in our construction project so this is a depend on of you i just say to manage how to manage them so this is very important so what training part a improvement training part in safety awareness we can continue the safety awareness make a uh, safety mat uh, training matrix monthly basis we have uh, already safety training matrix so we have conducted safety trainings every uh, every day every week the specific job specific safety training matrix toolbox talks must to must toolbox talk or uh, uh, we can say uh, a safety committee meetings and uh, and uh, the uh, weekly safety meeting review meeting these all our plans we have in place so we can improve and good health safety cultures at our project now next we are talking about the uh, third is a uh, third point fourth point is there mention <laughs> and the group meetings we have already told them ki we have must be conduct a group safety meeting group safety meetings so suppose that we are started we have started the uh, in our project group discussion standing safety meetings sorry for that today i am not well because of some fever and headache so that i not uh, i am not well to speech but frankly i am speaking 
I am very interested about our professional. So we are talking about the safety. So group safety training, group, group safety me meet meeting. So this is very important. If you are working a safety field, then make a good environment. How to make? Sometimes you make a group discussion. Suppose that uh, at, uh, uh, I am a safety professor, I am a safety manager. So then I have to have safety meetings weekly. He is standing safety meeting with the engineer and another is safety staff and every week so we can understand what are going on our position because of there are uh, 35 if 35 safety professors safety staff are there so we can meet everyone's and check the officers what are doing all those things on the what is the observations what are the expectations at project so this this is very good things to a good health safety improvement at your workplace. So group discussions. Next is we have um, and share the observations, share the learning in learning period. What we have learned during the week and what the scope of improvements. What is the difficulty you are faced? Then we have good solutions. I have already given to good solutions if if possible to i am directly he approach to oh, side management there is are a big difficulty how to improve this suggest me they are also suggest so this is a part of improvement a good health safety cultures because of everyone's arrogant people so maybe you if, if you are working in construction field there are very arrogant papers, politics, criticisms. If you are doing well work, if you are doing a good job, then after that criticism, uh, criticisms behind you. This is a fact. So this is very difficult. So don't mind any any, any criticism, politics, blaming, blaming. This is a impacting on your careers, you, our careers. After the JPSCM job project safety committee meeting also we have conducted in monthly basis as I already told. In house safety rules and regulations are there. In house rules do and don't. Suppose that we have restricted entry of 45, 55 years over, above the 45 years old person at construction site. This is a side rule, not there is nothing written in any legal law, but we have restricted. Because of if you are doing the high risk work, there are people are very, mm, very negligent after the old age in construction and also restricted 18 years below. This is a government rule. <laughs> this is a rules. So there are second thing we have many types of rules uh, develop in our project. Suppose that grinder machine in uh, big uh, with the latest technology, we have not we have said the if any material heavy equipment using at construction project act old five above the five five years old, then you should. Uh, they are uh, they are having uh, they ha must be submit the NDT test because of if you are um, second next past a few day before tower crunch has been uh, tower crunch and has been just at our project by the Sapuji Palanji the tower crunch is was very old then we have demand to to so submit NDT test before you start the work. So they have submitted in good manners. So this is our rule and regulations. And also we have banned the old passenger lift. Rejected from site. Don't want any oldest materials, which are very uh, uh, damaged. This is our good de de decisions by the safety teams at our project. So contractor replaced in new passenger lift. Now we are using new passenger lift new construction this is our achievement this is our a 
decision at our construction project because of there are very difficult to face by the senior management uh, my work is stoppage my work is delay my work is they are also speaking same person work delay don't stop the any work because i am not here to stopping any work i am here to i am here a good and good system implementation don't want any near miss any any accident our project this is my first goal and uh, we have to improvement at any or at any cost not acceptable at all in our area in our work period so frankly speaking in uh, our safety committee meetings <laughs> so this is a good things important of safety signage also we have display important of safety signage and uh, thus uh, we have uh, uh, safety instructions work method statement here also there environment uh, taking the safety precaution environment occupational health safety programs epr emergency response plan also are also there and statutory requirements also there and ehs performance also there are good practices also there and share to uh, our head and continual guidelines so this is our scope of improvements i am very positive approach to work our construction projects thanks for that thank uh, dear thanks for my watching my video hopefully you can improvements you should improvement at your professional if you are working the safety professional thanks for watching <coughs>